Hello guys, welcome to my channel and I hope you're all doing well. Thank you so much for clicking on this video and as you can see from the title, this is gonna be an unboxing video. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with the unboxing this this is gonna be a really quick one. So I got it from Valentino and just a clue, this is actually a shoe. I've been on a shoe craze the past few weeks. As you may know, I've already unboxed two other shoes that I bought and just a few days ago, I bought this one from Valentino just because I couldn't pass it, it's summer, so I, I'd like to um, get the most wear out of it during this time. So right in the bag, I have here the receipt. I got this from the uh, uh, Valentino store um, here in Qatar at the Villaggio Mall branch. So let's put that there. And the shoe comes in, of course, the red Valentino box. So let's go ahead and open it. I'm so excited. Um, I'm going to talk about it more once I show you the shoe. So you have here the dust bag. As usual, they only give one dust bag and some extra um, studs. And also, I think this is the care booklet. So that's two small envelopes there. Let's put that aside. And the shoes. is right here. Okay, let me just pull it out. Okay. Okay, so these are the shoes that I got. Um, this is called the, let's see. It just says um, PVC sandal and it's in the color P45 or Poudre just like my other Valentinos. I have two others in the same color, uh, the Poudre color. I really like this color because it's such a nice nude. It really complements my skin tone and I'm sure it complements a lot of skin tones because it's a really nice nudish color and it doesn't have any pink undertones. I think it's, it's, I think, yeah, the camera is capturing it well. I think it's just a little bit brighter on camera, um, but in person it's uh, a little bit uh, darker. And um, I got it in a size 41. Now, I would say that these sandals um, are actually pretty true to size because all my other Valentinos are a 41 and a half. So meaning I go half a size up for the others. But for this one, I got it in a 41. This is actually the biggest size that this shoe comes in. And yeah, um, it fits pretty good. And they also have another PVC sandal or slippers, which I'm going to put a photo here. Um, but for that one, it runs small. So I think I have to get it in a 41 and a half, but they don't produce it in that size. So I went with this one. It's actually also a lot nicer, I would say, because it has more studs. And also it has this strap here that keeps the feet from or keeps the sandal on my feet. So yeah, um, that's the shoes that I bought and I think I'm going to wear it today just to try them out. And as I mentioned earlier, these are in PVC material so it's like plastic and it's actually a substantial material even though it's plastic. It's really thick so it gives me a good support while wearing this shoe and also as you can see from behind, the studs let me see if it will focus. Yeah, from behind, the studs are really like embedded on the leather. Is that the right term? I don't know. But yeah, as you can see, uh, let me show you. Yeah, here. So each stud is placed that way. So it won't easily be removed. 
but Valentino has a good um, customer service actually when it comes to fixing um, their items because if one of these fall out, you have this extra studs, then you can just bring it to the Valentino store and they'll fix it up for you. It happened with my other Valentino shoes, the pointy ones. The heel um, was already flat and you can hear the metal from the heel and I just um, brought them in and they changed. I'd also like to add that since these shoes are in PVC material, that it's actually um, one of their cheaper alternatives compared to the other Valentino shoes that they have. So if you want to try out Valentino and you'd like to start maybe with something a little bit less expensive with their shoes, then you can try their PVC um, sandals. The um, least expensive that I found is the other PVC sandal, the one... Um, with this picture over here um, and then this is next and then the rest um, are a higher price because they are made of leather but since these are plastic then it's more affordable compared to the rest um, also i've been seeing a lot of reviews regarding these shoes that they actually hold pretty well because they're plastic you can even put them in water in sand in whatever pavement they are really indestructible and even though they have had it for many years it still looks pristine and it still looks good just because if you really if you dirty it or anything it's easily wipeable and i don't see it scratching really because it's a really thick PVC material. Let me zoom it in. So yeah, it just looks like so and in the back So yeah, those are the shoes. I don't think I have anything else that I forgot. If I did, I'm gonna put um, everything in the description down below just in case I missed anything about these shoes but yeah if you have any questions put it in the comment section down below and I hope that you enjoyed this video and hope to see you in my next one have an awesome and beautiful day bye guys